Alright guys, so we're back here with another video on the most exciting team in the NBA rebuild, which is the Charlotte Hornets. They have such a good, young, exciting team. Terry Rozier, LaMelo Ball leading the group. Miles Bridges, who I really like in real life. I think he has star potential. And then P.J. Washington. He's really good, but I mean, we all know what's happening with him right now. And Devontae Graham, too. Like, they got a squad right now. But we want to start off with some trades. Cody Zeller from Moses Brown. So we could have a nice young center in the rotation because we kind of need a center. And then this, this is really unrealistic, but we're going to trade Gordon Hayward, the veteran of the team, to trade for... Chris Middleton who is a certified bucket right now but so here's going to be the rotation going into the first year we also got Burke Lopez in that trade so he's going to be the starting center PJ Washington is starting Miles Bridges is coming off the bench we got three real young guys coming off the bench who could hopefully come nice but LaMelo Ball pl uh, playing point guard right now and he's like six foot eight which is kind of like what you want but we finish as the seventh seed here LaMelo wins rookie of the year Giannis wins defense player of the year and MVP um I don't think we're going to have anyone on the all NBA teams we don't so <laughs> one look at the team before the playoffs a few guys on fire right now uh, I think this team could like get an upset or something. We have a good squad, but we're only the seventh seed. Should be higher, I think, but whatever. Nice bench too. So we're facing the Brooklyn Nets. That's not good. That's the Katie Harden and Kyrie Brooklyn. Nets. Oh, we win game one though. Okay, one one, two one, two two. Okay, oh, lose game five, and oh, it's going to a game seven against the Brooklyn Nets. No way, and we lost, though, in a game seven. But we that's that's promising for our young team. We just sent it to a game seven versus the Nets. And, of course, the Pelicans win. Zion, the Sim God, it, of course, it has to be the Pelicans. But I'm going to trade our picks for two picks from the Suns there. Hopefully those become good. And also Brooke Lopez to Chicago for a first round pick as well. So in free agency here, we, we made those trades to clear up some cap space. And we can offer Chris uh, John Collins now. And we get him. Because I feel like in a lot of these rebuilds, we get John Collins the first year. I don't know why, but I feel like we do. And he's going to be a great addition to this young team. This team just got like way better uh with john collins and way more young too this team is just a bunch of young up-and-comers you know so sim the season here that was the starting lineup see if we could do some and we looks like we're gonna finish at the bottom of the playoffs and we finish as the eighth seed here yoke joins the mvp jonathan isaac defense player of the year uh, do we have anyone on the defensive or all NBA first team? Uh, no, we don't. So, um, here's the squad. LaMelo leading the way. Moses Brown down two overalls. But still, a pretty solid, a really good lineup for an eighth seat. So, uh, Miles Bridges coming off the bench. PJ Washington. Another guy I really like is Jaden McDaniels, actually. That's another guy I really like, but uh, we're facing the Boston Celtics. Let's see if we could uh, beat them. 1-1. Uh, one, one. Let's check out their squad, actually. Um, okay, so they pretty much have the same squad plus DeAndre Jordan. Uh, they're up 2-1. They're up 3-1. And... Okay, we tied up 3-3. Sim it. And we, oh, we come back 3-1 to the one seed. Let's go. Now we're facing the fifth seed, Miami Heat. We're up 3-0. Can we sweep them? We sweep them. Let's go. Now we're facing the Milwaukee Bucks. Giannis. Okay, they, we stole Middleton from them. So it's not, honestly, not that good of a team. So besides Giannis, they're nothing. So, Okay. They're up 2-0. Okay, there's a big game four, and we get the win. 
Big game five, and we get the win. Let's go. Can we beat them? And we win four games in a row to go to the finals, but now we face the Nuggets, and it's going to be hard to beat Jokic. Um, so, yeah, Jokic is kind of a god, but we win game one. Okay. Okay, they tie it up, and okay, a big game four here. We got to win game four, and we don't. So we're down 3-1. And they win the series 4-1, but honestly, you can't be mad. We're, we're an 8th seed that went to the finals. We overcame everyone and 8th seed in the finals. But we're going to trade a few first round picks here for Larry Markkinen, a guy I really like. And also, we're trading PJ Washington and Jalen McDaniels for Onyekwe Okongwu because those guys were kind of at the end of the bench and we needed a center. And. What's kind of funny is Lamella Ball and Onyekwe Okongwu actually played on Chino Hills, the same high school team together. And they were like best friends in high school or whatever. And so yeah, it's kind of cool. But uh, let's sim to the end of the season and we are going to finish as the two seed. Jokic wins the MVP. Who would have guessed? Um, okay, and now Jonathan Isaac also. And, okay, Kate Cunningham's averaging 25 a game. Let's see if anyone made the all-NBA teams this year. And, oh, LaMelo Ball actually made the all-NBA third team. Nice. Okay, so let's look at the squad. LaMelo up to a 90. Middleton, 87. Okongwu, 86. So a really nice starting lineup. The lowest overall is an 85. Scary Terry. And we got a nice bench with Markkinen coming off the bench. Michael Bridges. Uh, so yeah, we're facing the Detroit Pistons now. Um, okay, we're up 2-1. And up 3-1. Okay, and they tie up the series. You gotta be joking. What are, what's their team looking like? Oh, oh, they have Lonzo Ball. So the Ball brothers are facing each other. But besides that, I feel like we're a way better team, you know? So game seven, let's sim cast for this one. And we're down. We're down the entire game, and we're down by 20, and we're going to lose as the two seed in the first round. I'm shocked. I don't know what to say. But Timberwolves versus Bulls in the final. And the Bulls get a championship, and Kobe White wins the finals MVP, okay? So we couldn't do much at all in free agency because our cap space is not great. But uh, we we uh, kept everyone on the team, so we have the same team. Lamella O. Ball, John Collins, nice bench. Vernon Carey Jr. is another guy I like on this team. But let's sim into the end of the year. We finish as a one seed. Who would have guessed Luka wins the MVP? Um, and then these guys, Jonathan Isaac, who would have guessed? And then, so, did anyone finish on the All-NBA team this year? No, I don't think we had anyone. Wow, okay. So, LaMelo up to a 92. So, yeah, as we've had the last few years, a really good starting lineup. Um, and then a really nice bench, so... This team has championship written all over it. Uh, but we got to win the games. We're facing the Pistons again. Let's try and get our revenge on them from last year. We're up 2 0. Okay, and we're up 3 1. And we beat them 4 1. So we got our revenge from them. Now we're facing the Cleveland Cavaliers. We're up 2 0. 3 0. Can we sweep them? Oh, no. But we win in 5 4 1. Now we're facing the Philadelphia 76ers, up 2-0, up 3-0, and we sweep them, bring the brooms out. And now we're facing the Houston Rockets, who, oh, they have Jokic, okay. Well, Jokic, they have some twin towers there for big man, but, okay, we could easily win 1-1, 2-1, 3-1, and can we win? No, 3-2, and... We win a championship. We rebuild the Hornets to get a ring. We win a championship with the Charlotte Hornets. Michael Jordan wins his seventh ring as an owner. Let's go. And we have the Phoenix pick at number 10. And in the lottery, 
it goes up to the number three pick, so we're going to run it back for one more season, but we're going to trade this pick because we only got one more season in the rebuild, so we're not drafting a rookie. We're getting RJ Barrett, 88 overall, and also uh, I'm trading a few first round picks for a center because we're going to need a center because uh, a few guys left us in free agency because uh, Onyekwe, Okongwu, and Larry Markkinen left simply because we just have no money for them so but we still have a really good team you know that's what a gm does you know uh if some players leave us we could still uh, be fine like we are we lost two really good players but we're fine we still finish as the one seed um and yeah so luca wins mvp who would have guessed but hopefully we could win the championship yeah i mean we have everything that you need here so um is anyone gonna finish on the all and oh lamella ball on the all second team let's go so we are the one seed let's look at the squad one more time lamella ball 92 Terra's here vernon carey uh worked his way up to the starting lineup okay chris middleton coming off the bench so we're facing the philadelphia 76ers we're up 2-0 uh, three, one, and can we win? And we win four, two. Now we're facing the Cleveland Cavaliers. We're down two, zero, oh, and we're down three, zero. Oh? Who do they have? They have a seventy-three overall, and I mean a pretty solid team. Besides that, but we're still better. I mean, come on now, and we get swept by them. Are you joking? The Houston Rockets are gonna win. Because they have Jokic, who would have guessed? Uh, but here's the squad. Uh, we got one ring, went to the finals twice, made the playoffs every year. So pretty good. Like, subscribe, door.